Hey guys, Joe DeMarco from the Crazy New York Driver Show, Friday, April 17th, 2015. And tonight I'm going to show you how to edit your eBay store's search engine keywords. I'm sure many of you guys do not know that there is a big snafu with the keywords on all of your eBay stores. If you don't have a store, of course, this won't affect you. But if you do have a store, as most of you do, this will affect you big time. And I actually knew about this a while back, and I procrastinated. And just last night, Thursday night, Gladys Ramos and John Lawson were discussing this in the webinar that I attended. And I figured I'd show you guys how to do it right now and give you an example of what mine looks like. So what you have to do is go to your My eBay, which is where I am right now, click on this link here that says manage my store you'll click on that and it will take you to the next page which is right here and you'll look on the left side under store design see it it says search engine keywords click on that it will take a few seconds for it to load so don't worry about it if it does take a few seconds and I'm going to show you a big glitch that has happened on eBay that has to be corrected as soon as possible because it's actually going to be hurting your sales and you don't even know it. And when mine populates I will show you what has happened and what can be done to remedy the situation. Yes it's going to take a little time and here we are. Now here's how it works. On the left side these are your store categories right here. I've got my Chrysler Plymouth Dodge, my Ford, my Lincoln, my Mercury, etc. The second column is your primary keywords. Your primary keywords should be the name of your store, which in my case is Hubcap Joe's, and then the category, which happens to be Chrysler Plymouth Dodge. That's fine. Here's the problem. For some reason, eBay has defaulted the same keywords to every single solitary store category I have and it's wrong and it's hurting sales. For instance in the Chrysler Plymouth Dodge category right here it says Pontiac emblems, stickers for center caps, hub caps, alloy wheels, one 1997, 98, 99, Ford F-150, etc, etc. And it says it for every one. And that is something we do not want. It has to be changed. Now let me scroll down and show you something I did the other night just to give you an idea how it should look. Da, da, da. Okay, let's use t-shirts for instance. The other night I edited my t-shirt category with keywords that actually matter such as Poison, Hooters, Kiss Rock the Nation, Siegfried and Roy Mirage, WWE The Rock, Dwayne Johnson. I also did my license plates category. New York vanity plate, Connecticut, New Jersey, motorcycle, tags, year of issue. This has to be done with every single category in your eBay store. So let me show you really quick how to do one right now. We will do the Chrysler Plymouth category. You would click the right there that says edit now the primary keyword, Hubcap Joe's, is fine. Keyword number two, Chrysler Plymouth Dodge, that's fine. Now here's what you gotta do. You gotta change keywords from one to six, all right? The first one, since we're in the Chrysler Plymouth Dodge category, for argument's sake, let's just say I chose Reliant. Okay? That'd be number one. Second one, another popular Dodge or Chrysler Plymouth, let's just say New Yorker. Okay? Third one, let's just say Duster. Fourth one, Imperial. Next one, 
let's put Voyager and lastly we'll do caravan okay now you click Save there you can see it has taken now if you want to go back and do another one just click the link and it will take you back guys I know it's a little tedious but it's something that every one of you needs to do you know what's sad it's sad that eBay never came out and told us about this that we needed to do this I would have done this I probably would have done it weeks ago even though I've been procrastinating but I'm finally getting it done and I wholeheartedly hope that you guys found this little video helpful and that you guys will do yours see it populated there it is those are the changes I just made I gotta do all these others anyway thanks for watching this video I will talk to you guys next Friday night right here on the crazy New York driver show thanks guys and rock on and always remember I'm crazy New York driver and you're not